good. You got to start being more mindful of what it is that you accept. And I'm telling myself this because didn't they say in the Bible, um, the kingdom of heaven is inside of you? It says something like that. So I'm telling you, like, everything is already inside of you. Not to say there's nothing that you shouldn't focus on outside yourself, because, you know, there's people that are always going to be in that whole realm of reality. But focus on within. Actually, start doing this. You know what I'm saying? Start putting a little bit of attention into yourself, and you're going to start to see things for what they is. I'm telling you, just put a little bit of love. That love you give to God, Jesus, put that love inside yourself. Just a little bit of it. That means you got to put all of it. Put just a little bit of that, and you're going to start to see that things is not for what they is. Like, you have to give it permission. Basically, you have to give it the authority to go into effect. You know what that means? That's why crypto ain't working. That's why it ain't working. You feel me? It ain't working because of the fact is they know it's from within because they know where Jesus really is. And you know what I mean by Jesus, like the divine consciousness, that Holy Spirit. They know people like to refer to that as Jesus. So I'm going to just go with that whole, you know, right now, because people already understand that. All right. So people. So that's why it has to focus within. Why do you think 84 percent of the people believe that the is corrupt? The government is well, that shows that the people have the power. So what are they trying to do? Crash the system, drive up prices. So that way they can try to take a little power back, make you get a little thing. That's what I'm saying. Be mindful of what you watch. I'm just telling y'all the proof is in the pudding. And this is to help you in your everyday life. I'm not even using, I'm just using external things to help you fully understand because you relate to those things. You know about those things. You know you got to put about $4.99 a gallon in your tank every day just to go to work. You feel me? You know that you got to be mindful of what you see on social media because, hey, I just thought about that. I just said that. And it pops right up. And a lot of that stuff is staged. How you in a truck? How you driving truck doing TikTok videos? I'm like, what the shit? Don't you got to drive like 150 miles just to get to a load? It takes 15 hours. But you got time to sit in the truck and do TikTok videos and stuff. Grandpa, you better sit your ass down. You better go on somewhere with that shit. Like, I just, it, it, I'm just like, Flabbergasted, it's all a stage. So, with all that being said, you have to give it your permission. So, no, I don't get permission for crypto. I don't get permission for fake ass foods, the poison, everything. I, I don't give permission to allow things to go to that multi party system to where they're trying to incorporate one thing into one, trying to say some medical. Medical, I take care of my own medical. I'm sure you, hey, 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 you better rely on yourself because you know what hospital means. It's the Latin word for hospitable. It means hospice. Look up the word of hospital. I'm saying you're going to see that shit is not what it means. That word means to control and to tear apart some things in your body that ain't really putting it back together. I'm just leaving it at that. I ain't going to do it. But just look up hospitable, the Latin word for that. And I'm telling you, you're going to see what I mean because you've been actually putting on yourself. you actually been putting that shit on yourself. They So you see what I mean? They need you to put it on yourself to keep yourself in a motherfucking... Mm, mm, mm. That's it. So with that being said, it shows that something is within self. Right? And the best people to show you this, the best people to tell you this, the best people to inform you this is those who try to oppose you, including those who try to steal something from you. Thank you, people. Thank you, Dad. You just talk. I mean, I didn't. I would have never expected that there was that much inside of us, me, whoever watching this video resonated, unless people show us with that via action. So thank you so much. Thank you kindly. I really appreciate it, man. Hold on, I'm gonna sit down and just. You know, relax for a few minutes because, man, shit, I just want to show love to all the people that tried to steal my stuff, throw hate, make it more complicated, make it more flustered, try to mentally propagate, program my brain with these TikToks and shit like that. You realize for what it is because they know that is why all this water is rising right now. It, and it's only rising in the parts. I'm telling you that shows to have done something to, let's just say, ancestral line. I'm going to just leave it at that. I ain't going to go, I ain't want to really go in the past and bring up details like that. So, with that being said, you claim back that belief over your brain, yo, that belief over understanding inside self, 
Yo, you can do anything, literally anything. Do you know what that means? It means all your problems now goes away. Everything, everything. I ain't gonna say too much because you know there are always narcissist stalkers watching my videos, trying to be a type of information based off you know trying. And they'll come to you, hey, I've been watching your videos, huh? You know what I'm saying? So it's all good. I'm gonna leave it in the details. You have to be a real fan. You have to like literally watch my videos from beginning to end and really listen to me and know this information. You have to resonate with it, be on this frequency to really get the gist. Cause I'm gonna really, I'm gonna put this stuff into code. I ain't gonna really tell it to just the where the average joke could just watch something in my video and just pick it out and just be able to siphon information. Nah, I'm gonna put it into code and you're gonna have to watch multiple videos to see, to put all the codes together so that way you can come with an understanding. So that way you can learn the message. I'm gonna just copy what they do in, uh, you know, the government's all that shit like that. They do all that shit too. They be putting everything in code and then they're putting the secrets into code and then they, that's what the whole newspaper came from. That, but they ain't popular anymore. And they do the same thing with, now via what, what they used to do in newspaper, that's what they're doing via today's television shows. Tell lies to your vision, but there's really a lot of codes. I know you notice how certain things play out. So what I'm saying is take back that power because they already understand your power for what it is. So now you need to understand your power for what it is. Take back the power and be more mindful of what you give your power to. TikTok is a big thing. When you give your power to, I'm just using that because that's a heavenly program propagated thing. Why do you think that came up right now all of a sudden? It just came out of nowhere. And then you know it's Chinese on it and then Chinese is in link with these US gov, you know, so yeah. Think about it. I think they paid them to. That's why they gave them their city in each major city here. They got their own little town because they created TikTok. I know, right? It wasn't specific TikTok, but that's that little whole group thing. Hey, let's go into a multi-party and all use it. Nah, you don't need to accept that because I'm telling you, people tried to get you into that and they understand that they made a mistake. People tried to get you into that. I know, but they already saw that it didn't work out for them. So they saw that they were trying to, you already knew it, but you let them you let them learn that for, uh, for themselves. I know, because they're trying to get you into that crypto. You haven't noticed that? And you're like, nah, I'm good, I'm good. And then they end up losing everything trying to get you into crypto. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, oh, no, 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 no. I'm cool, shit. Thousand dollars was enough for me, man. Thousand dollars was enough for me. That was the whole thing. So because it's trying to get you to, to create that room reality because you have to create it. I'm telling you, they don't even have the power anymore. That's why the whole gut is freaking out right now because they know like 90% of their population. Oh, well, it's not their, their population, but 90% of the people that live in America right now, they don't mess with them. They know they're corrupt. They don't mess with them. We don't believe anything they say. We know they're driving up the market. We know they're, so I'm saying is, what do you think? Why do you think they won't take it to another level to try to hypnotize your brain? Because you know that little flash too that you hear these movies that actually is what makes you forget stuff i'm telling you they showed you in men in black they've been telling us stuff from this entire get-go we just didn't understand so what do you do when you find out like 90 percent of the people in america that they think they you know u.s government via their corporation which is not actually owned by the vatican what do you think that they yeah they're gonna want to get in your brain now so what do you think they're gonna go to your sources of of where you outlet your your places that you visit often. All right, they're gonna study that up the ramp. So well, I'm not even basing on them. I'm just saying in general, keep yourself off of like big platforms. When you understand what you really are, you just a consciousness in this vehicle, and you're living in multi dimensions right now. And each piece of that consciousness is living in a different vehicle in a different multi subverse. You'll know instinctively, like shit. What I believe really does matter because it's really just the consciousness that is really like the most important part. That is the Holy Spirit that they was all talking about. So when you understand that you have, you are the only one to approve things into reality. And that is what your base form was brought here for anyway, to create a better, better reality for other beings to come and cohabit, habit you, uh, habitate. But then you realize it was hijacked. So now you have to override those precursors before. And one of the precursors that you have to override is basically not believing just like they did in the matrix. This is just a dream. This is not real. You see how he just said not real. And he started to, he started to, uh, hijack the reality and bend it to his will. Pretty much that's all it is. So there is any, so, so, so when you come into understand this from social media, there's a lot more stress social media can cause if you're not aware and you don't hijack things. So when things are trying to take your power, you have to take that power back. It's always, you have to utilize forms of transmutation. Cause if you ever feeling like fatigued or drained or 
mixed emotions after you got off of, man, then that shows you that you were, you know, siphoning power from. So just switch that, transmute that. And this can only work for those pure ones. Like, you know, pure ones mean your intent is high. Because those who have malice intent, they can't hide their intent. They can maybe put on a mask, but you can never hide your full intent. That energy is going to seep from you. And I'm telling you, which is why it's so best that you keep your aura contained. That's why you don't touch so many people nowadays, especially watching this video. Don't touch people because you pick up their energy orc and that energy orc is already it's heavily toxic, polluted. So now you have to get rid of junk that wasn't yours. Same thing with social media. That's getting rid of junk that ain't yours. Same thing spiritually getting rid of junk that ain't yours. And once you finally do that, you'll begin to tap in and see things as more of a broader perspective. I'm saying, and you understand that, yo, it's all inside of you. Basically, that's what it really is, because inside of you is your peace. That is your contentment. So you fix that. You balance that. You're able to go and create whatever you want in this world. So that's why I recommend you tell like people your ideas don't don't tell people your ideas because they can put their energy feel or they can put their energy like intent on that to sabotage so if you ever notice you don't feel the same way after you tell people your ideas and stuff that's because they put their low intent on it so don't tell people your stuff. and people will be trying to siphon information from you trust and believe people will try this and you just need to be mindful of not to mess up yours i'm saying so, you know what I'm saying? It is what it is. All right, let's do 21 breaths. If you guys stay tuned in this video, you go. And we're about to do 21. That's going to get us into the higher field. This is going to release any clutter on us right now. All right, that's it. So if you guys enjoyed this, always, all day, like this video. Thank you guys for the ones who showed your appreciation via in the description box. If you would like to show further appreciation, you know, I really do appreciate it. Hey, yeah, I know right there, Ryan, but hey, man, you guys are really cool, man. Just keep raising your vibrations. I know things have been going amazing for you. Watch things start to change in the best way. I guarantee after watching this video, you're going to see things just manifest in a much more higher way. Why? Because you're aware. And now you can use that awareness to transmutate, magnetize to you what you we're supposed to create from the get-go.